guys, and thank you so much for tuning into my channel. So today I have a lore beauty box for December. Do you want to know what's in my box? Stay tuned. Okay, you guys. So my Allure Beauty Box for December just arrived. I had three or four boxes shipped out to me all at the same, pretty much at the same time. And all of them went MIA for at least a week. This one finally showed up now. My other ones, I'm still waiting to find out where they are. So <laughs> let's go ahead and see what is inside of the December Allure Beauty Box now that it's in my hands. So let's go ahead and see what's in this box. That's what it looks like when you first open it up. Down inside here, we'll go over the information about the items and it'll tell you what the retail value is if they're like full size, but if they're not full size, sometimes we don't know what they're valued at, but let's go ahead and just pull out. The first thing is a deep hydration, healthy glow daily cream. And, oh, this is on the very back. So this is not actually a part of the items. This is just like a free sample. If it's on the back sheet and it's in your box, it's just a free sample that they add to it. Now we have, it says, Mud Masky Leave Me On Winter Mask. Protecting, moisturizing, ultra repairing, nourishing, and anti-aging. So there's that guy. Now the full size is $45.85 for a 40 milliliter. And that's what this is. So this is the full size. And this is valued at $45, which is way over the cost of this entire box. The first step to softer skin in the winter. And it says, wash your hands and face, apply a thin layer to your face, leave the face mask on during the day, cold weather, daily use. Okay, cool. So you just leave this on. And you're good. I probably really wouldn't use this much for cold weather because <laughs> it doesn't really get cold, cold, not too, too cold for me anyways in Florida because I am already insulated enough <laughs> that I am always warm. So cold in me, just I'm really normally not cold. But if you do have like a lot of winter cold weather, this would probably be good to leave on your face to kind of help protect your face from the cold. So that's neat, especially if you're in colder environments. So there's that. And again, that's valued at $45 in itself. This La Roche Pose, I'm not sure how you say it, but this goes around in boxes a lot, mainly in Allure and Target beauty boxes that they do or like the little individual boxes that they do. But this one here says Retinol B3 Serum. And these, I don't even think these can even get any smaller of samples, to be quite honest. <laughs> so there's what it looks like on the inside. Oh, so it's supposed to be like this big old like serum type bottle. And that would be $39 for the full size. And then we get this little guy here. All right, the next thing says, buy me my beauty brand. It says black liquid liner and I don't use liquid liner so I'm not even going to open that. If you want to see what the tip looks like, there it is, just the tip <laughs> right there. And this would be the full size and it's valued for $22. So then the next item is, and every time I see this name I always say Clydesdale, even though I know it doesn't say that, but that's what my brain <laughs> wants to commute. So there you go. I know I get a lot of people laughing at me when I do, but I would say Clydesdale and it's not. It's um, something completely different. But this one, if you had the full size of whatever this here is, it's $49 and it would come in this big bottle right there. So there's a thirst quenching serum. Okay, you guys, so there's one product left in here and that is this guy. Okay, so this is Ciate London and it looks like it's a little eyeshadow palette. It says it's a nine piece eyeshadow palette. This right here is valued for $24. I'm not a huge fan of Ciate London shadows to be quite honest, I just don't care for them. So I will save this for a future giveaway as well, but that's the colors that is inside of here. And again, that's valued for $24. So basically inside this, I'm not keeping anything because I don't really use any of these little tiny things. I just, they end up getting lost if I even try to put them in my vanity area. And I don't use this. And this is mainly for like colder weather environments. So I'd rather go to one of you guys. So technically this whole box is just going into future giveaways. <laughs> 
You guys, comment down below. Let me know what did you think of this particular box. I mean, I like that they put in a, an eyeshadow palette. I just wish that it would have been like more of like a full size or like a bigger palette or something that, I don't know. I just wish it was something a little bit different, but you know. So that is everything that came in this month's Allure Beauty Box, you guys. We have the, the eyeshadow palette. You have a Leave Me On Winter Face Mask. You have a full size liquid eyeliner. And then you have these two sample sizes here. So that is everything that came in this Allure beauty box, you guys. Comment down below. Let me know what did you think of the items that were in this box. So now for Allure Beauty, they're charging $23 per month. You get some pretty good items and it's still worth it. But so far, I haven't really noticed a huge difference in the products, to be completely honest. I just see that they raised the price. <laughs> That's all I see so far. So you guys, comment down below. Let me know what do you think of this box? Do you see that there's a big difference with the price increase? Or are you on the same fence with me? Does it look like it's just the same and they're just charging more? I think $15 was way too cheap before. So I understand that they wanted a price increase, but I just don't think that they're justifying the way they're trying to make it seem with getting you better products when all the products look the same, in my own opinion. So, I mean, I normally do not complain about Allure because you always get the value that you get and it was priced so cheap, but now it's right pretty much with a lot of other companies. So what do you guys think? Do you think so far? I mean, I was giving them a few months with the new price point to see if I saw a difference and so far I'm really not, but there you go. <laughs> So you guys comment down below, let me know, are you getting Allure? Did you cancel Allure? Do you see a difference with it? What are your thoughts? Your positive interaction means the world and I greatly do appreciate it as I greatly appreciate every single one of you guys. So until next time, you know that drill. Keep a smile on that gorgeous face of yours and I'll see you on the next one. <laughs> Bye. Crafty crew, out.